Hey everyone, I'm Jeff with Polar Pro. Thank you very much for checking out the Defender. This is Behind the Build, where I'm gonna walk you through my favorite features and problems we are trying to solve when creating the Defender lens cover line. All 25 of us at Polar Pro travel and shoot a lot, and we all kept running into the same problem, finding our lens caps at the bottom of our bags. While traditional lens caps do offer substantial protection, they just never seem to stay on. Recently, some other companies have created these thin rubber sleeves which fit over the lens and stay on really well, but they just didn't offer enough protection for us and are kind of a pain to install. We wanted a solution that would not come off even during the most rugged travel, was simple to install, and offered as much protection as a traditional plastic lens cap. Esteban, our lead engineer, took this project head on and created, in my opinion, one of the most functional and novel products we've launched to date. At first glance, the Defender does look pretty simple, but there's actually a lot going on here. We spent eight months tuning in the molds to get fitment just right and testing different elastomers and polymers until we found the perfect mix. We have a soft elastomer here on the sidewall, which has a rigid enough structure to be pressed onto the lens yet is flexible and tactile enough so it's not gonna come off during travel. And that satisfied the easy to install and doesn't fall off criteria. But to make the Defender as protective as a lens cap, we had to develop complex molds that allowed us to fuse this rigid reinforced nylon plate into the product. I'm really excited about the Defender line because I can beat the crap out of these things and they don't come off in my bag. One challenge we had to overcome was fitting multiple lens sizes. So instead of just making one size that fit everything mediocrely, we decided it would be best to tool up five different sizes, ensuring the perfect fit for pretty much any lens. The sizing's mainly based on your lens's filter thread size. So if you have a 62 millimeter thread, you would choose the Defender 5562. If you have an 82 millimeter filter thread size, you would choose the Defender 7782. And we have the 95 and 114, which are for larger cine lenses. And the 95 and 114 are referring to the outer diameter of that lens. So for this Sigma lens, you would need a 95. And for something like a CP2, you would need the 114. If you're unsure of your size, just check out the lens compatibility guide on the product page. And of course, you'll be able to use these with or without your camera filters. All of us at Polar Pro are really excited to share the Defender with you. We've been loving it on our lenses for the last couple months, and I'm sure you will too. Thank you very much for checking out the Defender. Now get out there and capture perfection.